Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? I am back again. I know the webcam's still not working. I said it would. I want to load up on content while my roommate isn't here, just so I don't feel awkward recording in front of him. You guys can probably understand that. You know, I really want my face cam to work. It's just not. But um, today's video, I'm going to show some of what my friends have been making because, oh my gosh, they have been making some absolute bangers. So I was going to record this earlier, but, you know, a lot of the levels got raided. Starting off... Right away, we got Chlorophyll by Z Flare. This is his first solo. Uh, Flare is a really talented creator he, who has a lot of collab parts. And this is his first ever solo, and I wish I could beat this. It's also Extreme Demon, but actually, you know what, editor? We're just gonna throw in a video of this, and I'll give my thoughts on it. It's a really cool level. The pulses are phenomenal. I do wish there was a bit more going on though, because there's something missing from it. But for a first solo, it is phenomenal. Pulses on point match the song wonderfully. Oh, great job. Next level. I'm not, just because I don't skip past them doesn't mean they're not good. I'm just going to show the ones that stood out to me. Wada's levels are really good. Um, and all, Yeah, I, I can't just skip over a Wada level. I'll play a bit of it. It has a nice little jazz tune thing going to it. I think this is his last solo of the update. So, oh, I what a journey! Wow. Okay, I just got, <laughs> I just got the joke name reference, but this level is fairly good. Except for that, Wad is making some good levels. He's mainly a glow creator. I do wish he did more with colors and intensity. Oh my goodness. Uh, the clock. Hopefully, you guys can't hear that too much, but. The college I met has a nice little clock. Speaking of which, I got the same college as X Star Seven, which is kind of cool. We met up. We were gonna probably beat Duel Dulio Maestro or however you pronounce that together sometime. This level is really cool. I love Envy. You guys know that's like my favorite musician besides like Geoplex for Jump Trash, of course. But bunch gameplay always goes crazy. Like even for how simple it is, he can still match the energy. Okay, duels are always yikes. Okay, but you can you can kind of get a sense. Bunch made a banger. I like the first part the best. I'm gonna be real, not a fan of marginal, but is what it is. Oh yeah, here are all the levels I can't give feedback on because uh for my creator contest, for my creator contest, for my creator contest. Check this one out though. I love this level. This will be coming out afterwards, after the contest results, but uh, this is my friend Vortex. He hasn't gotten a level in a rated level in like four years. So uh, mods, if you're watching this, please help my boy out. He taught me how to create. I love that guy. He's so awesome. I met him in like seventh grade, and like I'm in my like if I was like if I didn't take a gap year, I would have been in my third year of college. So I've known him for a long ass time. Clockwork by Pika. It's such a cute level. I don't even know how to describe it. It's just the song is so beautiful. Oops. It's just so like light and fluffy, I guess. I don't know how to describe it. Like it's just a soft feeling level and it's really just, it's beautiful. The, the song and pulses match up wonderfully and the sync is great. When I first started playing this level, I wasn't a fan of the orbs like that you land on. But like once I found out there are indicators, I'm like, oh, this isn't too bad. But this is probably my favorite Pika level ever. and. I recently released a collab with Pika. This part, I'm not a fan of the gameplay as much because, you know, it's a bit, I'm not gonna say confusing, just not as good, but yeah, I love that Pika level a lot. Oh my gosh, this level by Gus Earth. Gus Earth popped the f off. Oh geez, I almost spilled my soda everywhere. Sparks gameplay and Gus Earth's like color choices. Ooh, absolute banger. I wanna beat this as my first Insane Demon. Once you see the drop, you guys know will know how much of a banger this level is. I wish I could play all my friends' levels right now that were recently released, but man, watch this. Oops. Oops. But yeah, as you can see, it's a really cool level. Colors are phenomenal. Yeah, that level's great. Metal Requiem, it's a cool level. I can't get very far into it, and I'm not going to play it in practice mode, but Cairo was like showing this on Twitter, and it is just really cool. 
Oops. It, it's really cool. The drop goes insane. I, I'm editor. Throw a clip in there. All right, and here's the level that made me wanna actually like make this video. It's Explorers by Optation, as you can see, got epic rated, deservingly so. I've been friends with Optation for quite a while, and he became one of my uh, better friends in Geometry Dash for sure. And I've been seeing him getting robbed of epic rates for quite some time. So I'm really glad that this level did because he definitely deserves it. And he's helped me a lot in my more recent creating a uh, journey. Like, you know, GMD Vortex helped me out during the start but Optation has really helped me out a lot during later, like the last few years at getting better at cream. So I'm like super glad that it got an epic rate. Anyways, I'll just hop right into it. I beat in this level, which is a medium demon, which you know, it's kind of crazy because I normally only beat easies, but this level is so good. I just had to, hi guys, colors are insane. Oh yeah, I can swear now because my parents are in the room next to me. I also like how Optation always uses for the object color, he uses black, so like on top of the blocks, it really pops even more, which I think is something, I'm not gonna say unique to Optation, but he's one of the only people I really see do that a lot, which I think really helps make his work stand out. When I, like, when I try to make levels, I try to be like Optation, you know, because this shit's good. Oh man, that part's a little bit bugged out. As you can see, this level's phenomenal. Give it a shot, it's really fun too. Oh yeah, Ranger made a really good level recently. I think this is his last solo before 2.2, because as we know, that's coming out later this month. The only part of this level I don't like is the first part. Oh yeah, that's probably where I died. Yeah, that makes sense, but I'll definitely check this level out later. It's really cool. Oh, I love this guy's levels. I don't know how to pronounce his name correctly. So I'm not going to, but I love his like 1.9 aesthetic. Everyone's gonna be like, oh, they actually just codex nug off. Shut the f up. <laughs> Sorry, I'm in an aggressive mood. I hate when people compare levels to other people's levels. It's just something that really makes me mad. <laughs> Especially because on my uh, creator contest, there was a lot of people saying, looks like this, looks like this, knock off of Blee. Like, dude, not everything is you know, copied from Bleed, Kulak, Edge of Destiny, Cytokinesis, like, y'all brain dead for thinking that. I'm gonna honestly have to cut out most of this rant because I will never be able to get mod if I say some of the things I want to say, or I've said. <laughs> but, yeah, just, if you're seeing this, don't compare levels to other people's levels. It's really demoralizing to us creators. Even if we did take inspiration, just saying this, like, in the comments, Cytokinesis plus Bleed plus, uh, Kog'Maw or Cosmos, it's like, dude, like, this is my own project. It's none of those. So please, you know, don't do that. Anyways, rant over. I like to rant. Oh, yeah, some random cow made a freaking banger, dude. He he said he quit. He dropped my collab, and he was gone for, like, a solid, like, couple months. And then out of nowhere, just returns with this. Now, you know what? I ain't even mad he dropped my collab. This is a banger, and I'm glad he focused on this. I don't even know. He probably did quit, too, but... I love this song. I first found this song through a uh, Lemons level, and as you know, Lemons is a goat, but I love- Okay, this is a Geoplex song. You guys know Geoplex is like my favorite uh, creator besides Envy for Geometry Dash songs. Dude, Geoplex needs to be in like movies for some of this orchestral stuff, because it is just so good. Okay, this is just a rant video. I gotta see. Yo, what's going on in Magic Tab? Oh, it's an awesome level. Taman came back. I know, crazy. Everyone's gonna go wild over it. It's gonna get epic, even though it doesn't even look that good. Sure, the gameplay's alright, but, like, I played it on my phone. So that's why it doesn't show up here. But, you know, it doesn't even look that good. Everyone's just excited he came back. You know, I am too, but, like, come on, guys. It's not that good looking. Don't give it epic. No, but... Jesus, did Yakamaru come back with another level? Hold on. Bro was dropping bangers. He was gone for two years, and now he's dropping three levels in the span of two weeks. You know what? I rock with it. Anyways, um, as you can see, my friends are making bangers. Check out their stuff. I wish I could talk about the levels that were entered into my creator contest, but I can't right now because as of now, the results aren't out yet. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I know this was a bit of a random, sporadic video, but you know, I want to keep you guys semi-entertained, even if it's not the greatest of stuff. Well, I'm in college just because I can't, you know, do the greatest things but oh yeah thank you guys for supporting me sorry for the lack of like actual uploads that aren't showcases but 
I'm getting back into it slowly. So uh, thank you so much. Uh, see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe or I'll kill you. No, 